Hi, it's Amanda, welcome to my channel. Today I'll be making pasta with chicken and broccoli, so let's get started. I'm going to season the broccoli and the chicken in the same way, just to maintain an even flavor in the dish. I'm gonna take some avocado oil, just drizzle it around the sides, and I'm also gonna add in some olive oil. For this recipe, I don't really want complex spicy flavors, so I'm keeping it very simple with the spices. I will be adding in only salt, oregano, onion powder, and garlic, relatively generously into the bowl. Thrive Market Ghee. When I put the broccoli in, I want everything to get coated, so it's just easier to distribute the seasoning if you have it on the sides as well. When I bake broccoli in the oven, I cut the florets in half. You wanna have as much surface area against the pan as you can because what is directly sitting on the pan is going to get the most browning. Pepper, so this is just one inch of a teaspoon. Meanwhile, I have a sheet tray in the oven as I bring up the oven to 400 degrees. I am gonna also add thyme and paprika in with the chicken. Chicken breast versus like a chicken thigh is very, very bland. So you wanna do more with the seasoning rather than less. I'm gonna cut up my chicken. Some rock salt on top of this. Even if I don't get the pieces directly laying against the pan, I want to make sure that everything is at least in a single layer. Olive oil spray. There you go. I have my stainless steel pan heating over medium heat, and I got a pot of water at the back ready for the pasta. Okay, when it sizzles, that means it's ready. I have a little bit of olive oil in the pan. I'm first gonna add some onion to the pan along with my set of seasonings. Let that brown a little bit and then I'm going to put in the chicken to brown. Adding salt draws out the moisture and I don't wanna sweat the onion so I'm gonna add the salt in a little bit later. It's got some nice browning on it. And that's because I left it alone. I think that smells good. Oh, it's good to hear. Thank you for that, buddy. It's me in the video. <laughs> okay, I gotta get the pasta. Your pasta timer is done. Sun dried tomatoes. Chicken. Next, I'm gonna add a little bit of my homemade vegetable stock. I'm just gonna drop in probably one of these. A little bit more shundai tomato. And then last, we'll add in the broccoli. It's too big to comfortably eat, so I'm just gonna chop it up a little. Get a piece with everything in it. Sometimes I surprise myself, it was really good. The chicken is really good. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you in my next one. Have a good one.